Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Doherty Dozen and this is my weekly grocery haul for my family of 14. But first, coffee. I remembered my bags this week. There we go. All right, I'm gonna start with the non-perishable stuff. Applesauces. I like these cinnamon applesauce pouches. I'm gonna get three of those. And then some of the kids just like the applesauce cups, not the pouches. Um sometimes I can find like a thing like this of them. There they are, down there. A lot of these. Any other fruits? No. Alright, we're having corned beef hash tomorrow for breakfast. Oh, reduced sodium. Okay. What's the difference? Roast beef hash, corned beef hash, reduced sodium. Corned beef hash. I don't know. Hormel or Libby's? Which way do we go? Can you go wrong? Let's go with this one. We'll get two of these and we'll get two of the reduced sodium. I'm gonna get more because oftentimes on the weekend Josh wants this and we don't have it. Alright, I was looking at the canned fish section to see if they had pickled herring for around the world night Sweden. I am seeing this um smoked herring. There is another section in the store we can check out that might have it, the international section. More olives. I'm gonna get some banana peppers. I had these on a sandwich, that veggie sandwich I bought last week. Oh my gosh, was that sandwich amazing. I didn't write it down, but I actually need some balsamic um, for the spaghetti squash. This Good, morning. Good morning. Some coffee. Okay, this Wegmans is, of course, set up differently than the other Wegmans. Why do they do this to me? Um, I'm gonna get some muffin mixes. Okay, down here. Maybe? There's brownies. There's cake. Okay, here's muffins. Blueberry. Blueberry chocolate chunk. Double chocolate. And cranberry orange. Yum. I'm gonna grab more uh, M&M's, chocolate chips. Actually, I do need more M&M's too. I'm glad I just misspoke that. We used the last of these on our waffle bar Saturday night. It was National Waffle Day. I made a big waffle bar. Oh, I gotta get sesame seeds. Let me go back and grab those. And they are all out. There we go. I actually was at Walmart this weekend and Wegmans. I'll post a shopping shorts, but um, I had grabbed some of the stuff off of this list. So I got some of the toiletries and I had gotten the stuff I needed for breakfast and lunch today. I'm trying to figure out where the breadcrumbs would be in this store. Well, I'm passing the cereal, so let's grab that. Bree is back on a cereal phase. She's eating um, cookies. 
Cookie Crisp. Where is it? Seasoning Fruit Loops and Cookie Crisp. A uh, lot. Um, if you're new here, Bree and Patrick are a sibling group that we adopted from a residential treatment facility. And their main diet while living there was cereal. So, for several years, that was pretty much what they ate. And we have really expanded their diet. But every so often, they do regress back to just wanting cereal. And whatever, that is best. I'm not seeing Cookie Crisp. Are you guys seeing it? Hmm. I'm gonna grab Raisin Brand too, because some of my kids are in multiple sports right now and they are eating more calories than the rest of the kids. Alex has Blunt and Raisin Bran. Okay, that's good for cereal. Need to get peanut butter. Speaking of extra calories, Deshaun is in three sports right now, so he's been eating um, peanut butter and Nutella sandwiches throughout the evening. Alright, I like this creamy peanut butter. Ooh, they have these. I'm gonna get these. Kids like to take them when they have an apple or celery. breadcrumbs over there. I just used the last of our breadcrumbs for the um, oh, moussaka. Moussaka. Sorry, I was saying it wrong. One ankle seasoning, bread seasoning, bread crumbs. You know what I'm saying. I'll have more canned corn. beans for the taco bar tomorrow. They're still good on Velveeta. There's a couple international things in this aisle and then there's another aisle over there. So I'm just glancing over here first. Get the fish. This Swedish in my comments told me not to try pickled herring. So I'm not going to go out of my way. But if I do find it in the store, I do kind of want to try it. All right. I thought there was more over here. Let me see. I could always go to the bigger Wegmans this week too. Well, over here, let me grab the tacos for the taco bar. I already have tortillas. I still have the Costco tortillas. Okay, I see. I get it now. I get why you shop at Costco. That stuff lasts forever. Um, let's just get, is this the biggest pack? Sometimes they have like an 18 pack. Um, yeah, it's like that. I'll have to get two of these. Maybe I'll get one, no, I'll get two of those. I'll get two of those. And then I'll get some of the blue ones, because I like these. The kids don't, but I do. By the way, those chickpeas I got the other week, amazing. Okay, you looked and I am gonna get this. It's the closest comparable thing I can find. I need to get the jelly. I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, I need some crackers. And there, lunch chips. Also, those chocolate rice cakes, so good. How are they 
out of plain M&Ms. <gasps> there we go. For the other cracker aisle, it's those pretzels Harley loves. Get some of these. Two, four, two of these. All right, they don't have the chocolate bunnies that I wanted for something. Well, at least not in this Easter Easter section. Snacky stuff. Like healthier <laughs> snacky stuff. big things of soup, but they do not. So I'll grab this four pack of tomato soup. I'm gonna grab this stuff, stack it on top of this cart, and then we'll go get another cart. Also, I'm looking for cream soda because I agree with you and you have cream soda for that Float challenge this week. Hmm. I'm not seeing cream soda. Ah, there it is. Okay, I need Dixie cups that I keep forgetting to get. Front and we get another card. All right, let's get the meats and breads next. Cart two. All right, I'm seeing if they have that veggie sandwich. Got any of those amazing veggie sandwiches? I do. They're in the pool. Would you like one? And they do. Okay. Well, that means I gotta get Josh something. There it is. That just made my whole day. I'm telling you, this thing is amazing. What's even in it? I don't even know. It's like sprouts and veggies and yeah. Oh my gosh, so good. It's some uh, turkey. Let's see, turkey off the bone. 
plus turkey off the bottom. for Easter. All right, chicken for the chicken teriyaki. I'm making this week on Thursday. I made lots of ground beef. I like the 80-20 split. call it meatloaf mix. It's also amazing in chili. It's also amazing in homemade spaghetti sauce. Alright. Hot dogs, bacon. I thought the Swagman's had the two and a half pound pack. simplifying my life and just getting this instead of homemade chili today. That's what we're going to do. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll put these back. Because it's a Monday and life is crazy busy today. I'm just going to throw these in a crack pot. and pepperoni are over here. Let me grab sausage first. On breakfast, the sausage links. Chobani flip. 
just now realizing I put spinach under dairy. I did walk right past the blue ricotta. last week for around the world in Greece. Alright, I need pepperoni for the pepperoni pizza pasta casserole. I'm trying to find whipped cream. I walked right past it. It was above the jello. This Wegmans, the almond milk is in a different section. At the one Wegmans I go to, it's like here with these milks. I always forget. Some eggs. I should have grabbed eggs when I was at Walmart Saturday. But I didn't.
over to the produce section. I just used up the last of the red onions. I like to have some on hand. Certain recipes call for red onions. Actually, I'll just get these. Put them in here. A little onion skin flakes. Don't get everywhere. blueberries I bought last night in the uh, blueberry french toast bake this morning which was amazing by the way can't remember if I said that all right let's get some grapes Jordan is in a grape phase so like not very many in a bag until next Sunday, so if I don't find it, I can always get that another day. Oh, I forgot any tomatoes for the taco bar. Oh, there's Hazel. Oh my gosh, there's a doggy. Hazel. That's okay. Leaves all wet. All right. Spaghetti squash. And I dropped my grocery list. So, this is spaghetti squash. If you've never had it before, you bake it up, you cut it in half, you bake it. And I'm telling you, it tastes just like spaghetti, but it's squash. So I don't need to get that. All right. 
Awesome. Okay, I don't really want to go get a fourth cart, so I'm just gonna get these things in this cart. Alright, I want to get Danishes for breakfast on Wednesday. I wonder if he's good until 3.28. And sell by 3.28. They'll still be good Wednesday morning, right? Links. I just need hash browns, but six garlic bread. So I'm gonna leave that there with my other two cards and just walk over to the frozen section. I think we're good for today anyways. Okay. Okay. Go. Sandwiches. I'm gonna drive over to the side door to load everything in. This has nothing to do with nothing, but as I walked out of the store, there was a elder, an elderly woman trying to get her cart trolley into the motorized shopping cart. Her purse had fallen. She was struggling to get the cart in. And as I'm walking out, you know, I had some ways to walk. I'm watching people walk past her, like grown people walk past her. Why? Why do we do that? stop help anyways i helped her she's good picked up her purse helped her get her shopping cart trolley in her uh, motorized shopping cart but i don't know it just kind of blew my mind that like people were just walking past her when did that happen when did we stop helping each other anyways that's my rant for today okay we are loaded in takes up all the seats and all the floor space of this 15-seater van. I'm gonna eat my sandwich, pick up Harley, go home, put the groceries away. All right, I'm gonna show you what's in this sandwich. Lettuce, tomato, sprouts, onions, and pepper bananas. Whatever like mayonnaise or whatever they have on it. It's like a sun-dried tomato type mayonnaise. It's so good. Harley in the process of picking up Harley I got a call 
call from school that I gotta go pick up Bodie. He's just having a day. Uh, I could make him suffer through three more hours of school miserable or just go pick him up and he can have a chill out day. He, um, I don't know, every so often he just fixates on one thing like it could be a cough or like right now he's fixating on his eye itches although his eye looks perfectly fine so it's not like pink eye it might be allergies but anyways he's to the point where he's so distraught over it that the teachers end up bringing him to the nurse and the nurse ends up calling me and they're like should we keep him here and i'm like i'll just pick him up he's on my way home anyways hang out with Bodie, okay actually you look like you're gonna take a nap because my teens will come with us again. I mean, they're gonna pretend they hated every second of it, but at least they'll come. <laughs> we should do that. Maybe we'll do that for Sunday fun day. I don't know, we should do that over April break. That'll give us something to do. The kids have a whole week off next week something to do one of the days we try and do something every day just to get out for a little bit yeah. not just like sit in the house every day no you don't like those pants with the sparkles on them mm -hmm. they're, itchy. they're itchy yep as soon as we get home let's go in and pick up Bodie mm -hmm. I got Bodhi, I got a van full of groceries. We are home. Here is the receipt for this week. I got to load it into my Fetch app. Okay, I brought all the groceries into the garage. I put the milks and stuff away. I'm gonna do the rest later. I'll put that in a separate vlog, in a restock vlog for now. I have Bodhi who wants me to help him build his Buzz Lightyear Legos. So we're gonna do that before I put the rest of the groceries away. Thank you for coming grocery shopping with me. You are strong, you are beautiful, you are loved, you belong, and I'm so proud of you. Your face is a mess. Harley just had lunch. <laughs> See you next time. <laughs>